Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Spellbinder doing a report again on the Soho images of the sun. October 3rd, 2011. I made an observation here about this. Someone actually, in my last video, made a, uh, made a comment saying, Why don't you talk about the ring of sunspots on the sun? You know, this northern hemisphere ring of sunspots that go all the way around the sun. And then I started thinking about it and I go, hmm, it's right. Should do one on that. The ring of sunspots around the sun, as you can see, looks like a crown. That's where I see it as. It looks like a thorny crown. The sun has a thorn crown. Hmm where we heard that before. Anyways, as you look at it, it does look like a crown of thorns, maybe, going around the sun. Maybe Zeisgeist is correct on some aspects of how everything's related to the astrological signs. As you look at this, you can also see on the bottom there's a ring starting to go across here. Now when these two rings completely form on the Sun, I fear and feel that we're going to have some major coronal mass ejections coming off the Sun because they'll then be able to jump between these two and have huge explosions. And if they happen on the side facing us, we're going to get a piece of that and we may be sent back to 200 years before we had electricity. Let me just go through these so you can see them. The ring of fire on the sun, or the ring of sunspots. The crown. This one shows really how active it really looks. This one shows you in the red spectrum. But this is interesting. We're starting to get this formation. Maybe this is the reformation of the 1800 incident where it took out the telegraph lines. And today with all the power grids and miles and miles of underground pipe, i just give you a warning. Do not be touching anything metal when the CMEs reach Earth you may just find yourself fried to a crisp with the amperage and everything that will be created from all this. It's pretty scary in that respect. This is what it looks like here today. Then you got today's imaging on here. Let me see if I can get the theater to work here. You type in 2011-10-02 and go and do it again for today's date 2011-10-03 and then put it up here let me bring it down line this all up nice and neat on here so you can see what it all looks like from yesterday through up to when the pictures stopped. There's 146 pictures. And this is what the sun looks like after the comet impact or the electric comet as the Thunderbolts organization would say what comets are. They're actually reverse opposite charges and as they get near the sun, they become energized and light up like a flare. And this is how it looks right now. Hopefully it will go to 03. Looks like it might. There it is, 03. We had another flare off of 1302. Luckily now it's not facing at us, so we won't get that. 
Now I'm going to go back and I'm going to put it on C2. Hmm, interesting. For some reason another C2 is not... Oh, there it is. And I'll show you up close and in the red spectrum the activities on the Sun. That run through this showing you how active the Sun really is. It looks like we're getting ready to have another super storm that hasn't happened since the 1800s. It's just the way the rings, the ring of sunspots, north and south hemispheres are starting to form. The one in the north is already formed, the one in the south is forming. And I think this is the uh, solar cycle where the solar, the sun's uh, north and south flip on itself. So that's going to happen this time in this cycle also. Which may be why we're seeing such activity on the sun as the ring of of uh, sunspots. But there it is, the northern ring and the southern forming. We could be in for some heavy solar weather coming this way. And I would say something wicked this way comes. Well, that's all I have to really say. Just wanted to point out the crown on the sun. The sun now has a crown. Zeitgeist might be something to consider in this respect. Well, until next time, this is Spellbinder saying, be good, or be good at it. Be prepared for anything that might happen, because the way it looks here, the sun is getting super active. As I said, when you get the rings in the top and the rings on the bottom, how can we not miss a CME direct hit on the Earth? Taking out the power, taking out satellites, something to say. Be prepared. Until next time, this is Spellbinder saying, be good. Or be good at it. And have a good day.